at Delhi, Lord Louis Mountbatten arrives to take up his appointment as India's Viceroy and Governor General. At a crucial moment in India's history, the 47-year-old grandson of Queen Victoria becomes the 29th and last Viceroy. The first to hold the office was Viscount Canning in 1858, the 21st year of Queen Victoria's reign. To greet the new Viceroy come the Indian leaders. Pandit Nehru, Oxford-educated leader of the Congress Party, second only to Gandhi. With Nehru, Muslim Abdul Azad, head of the influential Congress Party. Leaving Delhi's Viceregal Lodge is Lord Wavell, outgoing Viceroy. To the Governor-General's bodyguard, Field Marshal Wavell bids farewell. During his term of office, Britain made the decision to leave India. Now it is for Indian leaders to decide the future of their country.